Tensions have risen in the West Bank in the run-up to this month's Israeli parliamentary elections. Clashes erupted in the town of Tamun after an Israeli raid to seize members of an alleged militant group. According to Palestinian reports, youths threw stones and some soldiers responded with live fire. Elsewhere, and there was more violence when Jewish settlers attacked a village near Nablis, damaging homes, uprooting olive trees and torching a lorry and tractor. Graffiti was also sprayed, including the slogan Price Tag, which is a euphemism for revenge hate crimes by Israeli extremists. In Jerusalem, bulldozers backed by Israeli police demolished a Palestinian house. It belonged to the family of a hunger-striking prisoner being held in Israeli detention. The brother of the prisoner said, We were surprised that at 5.30 in the morning the soldiers came knocking at our door and said they wanted to demolish the house. They did that and left but I hadn't received any notice or warning that they intended to do this. Palestinian-Israeli tensions often spill over into violence before elections. This time, a religious party favoring settlement building in the West Bank appears to be gaining in popularity.